Hello and welcome to this episode of The Small Talk. Here we discuss important topics and sometimes not so important ones in small, simple and concise manner. This is not a deep diving into the subject, but a small talk just enough to try and make you curious for further exploration. Let's get started. Bacteria are microscopic single-celled organisms that thrive in diverse environments. These organisms can live in soil, the ocean, and even inside the human gut, practically anywhere. Commonly bacteria have a bad reputation, but many bacteria are not harmful. In fact, some are actually helpful, including the majority of bacteria that live in our intestines. However, disease causing bacteria can cause illnesses. Antibiotics, also known as antimicrobial drugs, are drugs that fight infections caused by bacteria in both humans and animals. Antibiotics fight these infections either by killing the bacteria or making it difficult for the bacteria to grow and multiply. The management of microbial or bacterial infections in ancient Egypt, Greece, China and India is well documented. However, the modern era of antibiotics started with the discovery of penicillin by Sir Alexander Fleming in 1928. Since then, antibiotics have transformed modern medicine and saved millions of lives. Antibiotics have not only saved patients' lives, they have played a pivotal role in achieving major advances in medicine and surgery. Antibiotics have also helped to extend expected lifespans by changing the outcome of bacterial infections. In developing countries where sanitation is still poor, antibiotics decrease the morbidity and mortality caused by foodborne and other poverty related infections. Antibiotic resistance occurs when bacteria develops the ability to defeat the drug designed to kill them. When bacteria become resistant, antibiotics cannot fight them and the bacteria multiply. Antibiotic resistant bacteria are often more difficult to kill and more expensive to treat. In some cases, antibiotic resistant infections can lead to serious disability or even death. A growing list of infections such as pneumonia, tuberculosis, blood poisoning, gonorrhea and foodborne diseases are becoming harder and sometimes impossible to treat as antibiotics become less effective. In many countries without standard treatment guidelines, antibiotics are often prescribed by doctors, health workers and veterinarians and are overused by the public. In places where antibiotics can be bought over the counter without a prescription the emergence and spread of antibiotics resistance is even worse without urgent action we are heading for a post antibiotic era in which common infections and minor injuries can once again kill tackling antibiotics resistance is a high priority a global action plan for antibiotics resistance is needed to ensure prevention and treatment of infectious diseases with safe and effective medicines check out the part 2 of this episode where we discuss some of the actions we can take to reverse the menace of antibiotic resistance that's it for now do let us know in comments below topics you would want us to cover in future small talks if you like what you saw do consider subscribing to our channel more small talk for another episode We will see you soon.